hi guys and welcome back to my channel if you're new thank you for stopping by my name is vanessa and you're welcome to my channel welcome to i'm going to be showing you guys how i achieved this real cute real sweet really easy valentine's day makeup so if you're going out for dinner you're going out for lunch this is the look for you honey so sit down and let me show you how i did this okay today we're going to be doing our face first i'm going to take this mary Kay oil control my light is making this not so focused but this is a mary Kay oil control lotion i use it as a primer and it really helps to control oil and shine throughout the day because you guys know i am like a grease ball i'm super oil guys i thought i was recording but i wasn't so i just put this um adventure pro makeup concealer and i'm using this as my color corrector today I for my foundation today i'm going to be using my fenty beauty foundation this is a pro filter this is so ghetto this is ghetto but we don't waste makeup products over here, okay? Is, there's nothing coming out of it again. I'm not throwing this bottle away because this shit is expensive. So now we have a nice blank canvas. I look like an egg. <laughs> To contour my face with the same adventure makeup concealer this is a darker shade i'm going to be using these two concealers to highlight my face this is the juvia's place and magic concealer and the Fenty Beauty Pro Filter Concealer. I'm using the Juvia's Place one first. I'm just applying it because it's really bright. Then I'm putting the Fenty Beauty one on top and highlighting the rest of my face with the Fenty Beauty Concealer. I'm also contouring my nose like because I like to do this after I highlight and I'm using a cream foundation stick to contour my nose. I recently started using liquid lipstick um lipstick as blush and it's just amazing i really like it like i really really like it now i'm going to set my face i'm going to be using this powder palette first of all from glam beauty pro cosmetics i'll be using this really light shade these two light shades here and then i'm going to go in with the makeup revolution loose setting powder to brighten it up Then I'm going to take a darker shade in that same palette and use it to set my whole face. My whole face is set and we're looking flawless already. Can you guys see? I haven't gone in with this uh, Makeup Revolution powder yet to brighten, but I'm going to bronze my face first with the Makeup Revolution Splendor Glow Bronzer. guys i'm done with my brows now and i'm baking a little bit i know you guys must be tired of seeing <laughs> this palette in every makeup video but it's just really versatile like it has all the colors i need and you know it's just so nice i need to take this makeup revolution palette and i'm going to start off with this shade 
of this Juvia's Place palette, I mean, I'm going to start off with this pink shade over here. I'm just blending it into my crease. Then I'm going to take this dark brown shade from the um, Revolution palette and use that to deepen up my crease. Then I'm going to take this um, light powder from the powder palette and use that to blend out my brow bone area. You know, so everything just flows seamlessly and looks very well blended. So I wanted to do like a really light cut crease but <laughs> I ended up doing a very defined bone which is not bad. I'm taking that dark brown shade and just blending at the edge of the um, concealer or whatever I used to call my Take this pink shade here and just put that all over my lid. Going to um, apply my liner and lashes, and I'll be back. Am I just tripping? All these lashes are like really overboard because I know they are like really long. These are, like 25 mm lashes. I'm going to do blush now. I'm using the same pink shade I used earlier on for my eyes, and I'm just going to add some color to my face. Then I'm taking the brown shade I used earlier on and just smudging that underneath my eye. I've come to the conclusion that these lashes are not too much, so I'm going to leave it. I'm going to take this Pixie Face Palette and I'm going to use this really nice rose gold shade to highlight my face. I'm putting it in my inner corners first because this is like a really pretty highlight corner, a color. Then I'm going to highlight my nose and then my cupid bow and then my cheekbones this is such a soft and pretty highlight shade i'm so shiny <laughs> let me just press everything we're looking cute already i'm doing my same old nude lip because this is enough drama already like so i'm just i'm just lining my lips with my brown pencil as usual and then I'm going to take my nude lipstick. I always use this nude lipstick. I'm using this just all over my lips. Then I'm going to take going to this add this gloss Zaron from gloss. Zaron Cosmetics. It's, it's called really Naughty nice Lip Gloss. And I'm going to apply just a little bit to add some color to the lips so it matches the eyes. Then I'm going to go over it with some clear lip gloss, and that's it for the lips. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> this is how we're looking right now. I'm going to use my MAC Prep and Prime Fix Plus Spray. Hey guys, so this is the final look. Can you see my face? Like, this is such a freaking beat. Wow. I look cute AF. And that's on what? That's on Mary Had a Little Lamb Bitch. Because, <laughs> child, can you see this beat? Hey, God. What is this beauty now? The oh, Lord was speaking to me because, honey, this is a beat. This is a beat. This hands. See this hands. This hands. Blessed by God. <laughs> but you cannot tell me this is not God's handwork. Can you see this face? Like, so you guys, let me know down below in the comment section if you be rocking this look on Valentine's Day. Because, I mean, I am. Me, I know I am. The look, such a vibe. I think the lashes just like took this to a whole nother level. I need to do more 25mm lashes. If you stay to the end of this video, your real one. Thank you. I love you. I'll see you guys in my next one, okay? Make sure to subscribe to my channel and, you know, like this video. Bye!